I'm going to show you how to shift the contrast colored yarn when the rounds are getting longer. So you're going to move to the right. Right now I'm working the main color round. So I've been working knit one, slip one across my needles. So knit one, yarn forward, slip one, yarn to the back. Knit one, slip one with yarn in front. Here's my parked contrast color. I take that and move it to the back. And then I continue with my knit one, slip one. And I will do that all the way to the end of the round. Knit one, slip one, knit one, slip one. And you notice I'm leaving a nice trail of alternating colored stitches in that section. Flip the work. Okay, so I've turned my work and we'll do some more of this coming back. So we've got knit one, slip one, knit one, slip one, Okay. Knit one, slip one, knit one. Yarn forward. So you saw that was the last contrast colored stitch that I worked. I knit it. I'm slipping the next stitch. I'm knitting that stitch. Yarn forward. I'm slipping. That's the second main color stitch I've slipped. Now I take my contrast color and park it. And now I continue with my knit one, slip ones. And of course, if this, this being the, contra the main color round, I would continue that all the way to the end of the round. I'm not going to do that here. For time's sake, I'm going to turn my work and let you see what this looks like then when you go to work your contrast color. So on the contrast color round, you're going to have to slip stitches until you get to where you need to be. And I tell you how many stitches to slip in the pattern, but, but you can see, you know, you can eyeball it because you can see this is where you were on the previous round with the contrast color. And you know you need to be just one to the right. So you can see that you slip Slip, you know, you see the pearl bump, so that's not going to be the one I start with. This looks like a knit stitch. We're going to start there. And you can see that's going to be the knit stitch that's over from this column. So then we're going to do knit one, slip one. Knit one, slip one. And we'll do that down to the end. Almost there. Okay, so I got all the way down to the end. I'm going to turn it. Uh, okay, I've got it turned. Okay, and then I'm going to come back. Knit one, slip one. Knit one, slip one. And I'm going to keep going. Knit one, ah, getting it caught in my fingers. Slip one, knit one, slip one. Okay, so there's the last one. Yarn to the back. I'm going to actually slip two. And you saw how I hide this. I bring it around behind the first one I'm slipping and then in front of the second one I'm slipping. And when I flip the work around, you can see that I've parked where I've parked it, which is where it was parked to begin with, two stitches over from where the color changes. So that is how you work the contrast color in the rounds where the contrast color is getting longer.